very good example of just about any place you're going to go for today. Lots of slippery conditions out there. So as you're coming out of the neighborhoods this morning, be, be very, very careful. When you get to the main roads, it'll clean up a little bit, so it's not quite as bad. But as you're pulling out, you may find, like a friend of mine did last night, uh, that he's greeting the uh, sign that names my street. So, uh, you know, be very careful as you're pulling out. Right now, temperature's down to 11 degrees at uh, Stanford Field. We picked up about a third of an inch of rainfall yesterday. Actually, rainfall is being generous with that. Uh, we had a little bit of freezing drizzle, freezing rain, snow, a little bit of sleet, just about everything mixed in there yesterday. Only time we had rain was when the high got up to 33 degrees, and that was at 345 in the morning yesterday. Otherwise, we were below freezing the entire day. Low temperature for uh, today so far has been 11 degrees, our current reading. Humidity is at 84% currently. The winds are out of the west at 13 miles per hour, and the pressure is 3029. It's on its way up thanks to high pressure that's moving in. That high is going to give us sunshine for today, but in the meantime, it's also going to allow temperatures to be very, very cold, not only for today, but for tonight as well. As far as the radar is concerned, no precipitation showing up anywhere close to us. All of the precipitation has now moved off to the east coast, and we'll continue moving off to the east. I don't see anything coming our way for the rest of the week, as a matter of fact few clouds here and there, but generally we'll see clear skies. Freezing drizzle last night covered most of the bluegrass. Back up to, the, and by the way, we had some flooding problems even further south down here where it was just in the form of rain over the mountains. Back up to the north of that, the, you can see the line we had as far as the uh, snow is concerned. Less than an inch of precipitation fell through this entire area all the way up into southern Indiana. However, by the time you get to Indianapolis, snowfall amounts started to uh, build up a little bit in the northern sections up there as well. The latest satellite picture shows clearing skies over much of Indiana. You can see the cloud line as it moves through the bluegrass. All of the precipitation now off the east coast and moving in that direction. We're getting some good returns showing up in parts of New England, eastern uh, parts of Ohio, western parts of Pennsylvania and western New York. All of this is in the form of snow, by the way, moving up to the northeast and the heavier showers here as well. That's going to be the case for today. We'll see lots of sunshine as high pressure is moving in. The forecast for today, mostly sunny skies. It'll be cold today. The high will reach 22 degrees with 11 degrees out there right now and wind chill factor down below zero. Bundle up as you're going out this morning if you're doing some of that last minute shopping especially. For tonight, we're looking at clear skies. It'll be cold once again. Low temperature should bottom out around 10 degrees. So very much like, for, like we're uh, experiencing today. For tomorrow, Christmas Day, looks like 33 degrees will be our high temperature with mostly sunny skies. Sunny on Wednesday, up to 27 for a high. And then the warming trend really starts to settle in. 31 degrees on Thursday, a few more clouds. But Friday, 41 degrees. And that's pretty close to normal for this time of the year. We'll see lots of sunshine on Friday, too. Next uh, rain event looks like it could be over the weekend, but that's going to be about uh, the best we're going to be able to do. That's the forecast for now. Have a very Merry Christmas. And here's Gene. Thanks, Craig. In just a moment, we have more things to share with you. We have the Broadway Ensemble from the Broadway Baptist Church coming up. And I have a tip for you, incidentally. I'm from northern Ohio, and I learned this a long time ago, that when the weather's really cold, it's a good idea to put a tin can and a candle in your trunk so that if you have car trouble or for some reason you get off the road, you can light that candle inside the tin can, and it'll put enough heat inside your car to keep you from freezing, keep you cold or warm all night long in the coldest kind of weather. Right now, let's take a break. and will be with you in just a moment. Are you listening in the lane? Snow is glistening, a beautiful 